Okay everyone, welcome back to another video on the Fox Tech YouTube channel. This time we talk about photos and the topic is how you can adjust the size of a picture on your iPhone. And there are multiple things that can cross your mind or things which you may refer to when you say that. First of all, when you just open up the photos and you want to change the size and you want to just crop it and make it, for example, you want to cut out this, you want to make the photo look square rectangular, whatever you want, right? If that's the case, just click on edit like this and go to the crop tool at the bottom. So you can just grab it in the corner and make it smaller, larger. You can make it thin. You can make it just like that, anything you want. If this is like adjusting the size, if this is what you meant by that, this is currently possible. Of course, you can all just go to the, um, not go from the free form, but perhaps just switch to square or make it a wallpaper size or different aspect ratios are available to you. Portrait, landscape, many different things. So it is up to you to decide how exactly you want to change or adjust the size. Very interesting stuff is where you, for example, on iOS 17, when you are inside a photo and you just zoom it in entirely, you can see that you get the crop in the upper right corner right there by default. So yeah, if you zoom it in a little bit more, you can click on crop and you get to the basically the same section as I've shown you just before. But this is just one aspect. The second one is adjusting the actual size in terms of megabytes. Because if I swipe up on it, you can see that this picture is 181 megabytes, which is fine. But this one, seemingly the same one, is 7 megabytes, right? The one next to it is 4.3 megabytes. So how do I adjust it? Well, for that, I like to use an app, which is a compressing for the pictures, a compressor app. So this is what it looks like. I like to use this one. It's called Compress. If you look it up inside of the App Store, you're going to notice that it is literally just right here. Just look up compressed photos. You're going to be able to find a few. They all work the same way. Some may have ads, some may be without ads. But basically, you open up the app and you just select the picture that you want to compress and make smaller. Let's say it's going to be this picture right here. So you click on it next. And you can play with the quality, right? So you can make it larger, you can make it smaller. And of course, the more a quality it has the larger it's going to be so you have to play with it and just slide it up and down to see what the result you want to come up with and just click on compress and then you can save it to photos in the lower size so this is basically how it works if not you also have the option to go to safari and look up some kind of compressor online so you can check it out right here compressjpeg.com where you can upload files compress them and download them again so you can use safari you can use it on your computer as well the possibilities are there, but these are the basic ways how you can adjust the size of images on an iPhone. So guys, this is the Fox Tech educational platform. You can join it for free. It's going to be linked down below in the description. And when you join it, you can watch many different courses on video editing. I just finished, for example, the full guide, full course for a dynamic island. I believe it's crucial to know how, you, how to use it properly. And you also have the community section. As I say, it is free to join. So go ahead and do that right now. I'll wait for you inside. For now, thank you very much for watching. See you guys later.